So this is an older uh, video. I'm just now putting it up. Basically what happened is I checked the weather. The weather was supposed to be good until late afternoon. So I figured I'd take a nice early morning trip and do some fishing. Well, the weather came in a lot faster than what I thought. Check out how fast this storm band comes in. So obviously you can hear the wind, but then right above me you can see that that storm band, um, the top left of the screen. It comes in, the wind comes with it, and I start to realize that uh, the weatherman was wrong and I need to figure something out. All right, so I sped this video up. Basically, I'm just riding the wind. Uh, I'm probably two and a half miles from the boat ramp. I'm lucky because the wind is pushing me in the direction of the boat ramp. So I'm just kind of trying to ride it out and figure out what it is I'm going to do. Um, I was hoping that maybe it would calm down after that first band went past me. But if you notice up in the top left, uh, the, a second band comes in, and it's worse than the first. So I've got to figure something out. Um, yeah, the weather's not cooperating today, and uh, something's got to happen. So back to normal speed. I, uh, I kind of want to show you what's going on here. So the wind's coming in. I'm in kind of a bad spot right now. You don't want the waves hitting you broadside, right? And that's kind of what's going on. I need to get my kayak turned in the in a better direction. Problem is, I've got current coming one way. I've got wind coming the other way and it's so strong that it will turn the rudder of my kayak and spin me in a direction I don't want to go. If you notice, um, the waves coming in, when they hit broadside, it really rocks the boat left and right. You don't want to get hit broadside. Um, you can definitely flip, water crashes over, everything gets wet. Um, Right now, I'm just kind of riding the waves, trying to get to a, a safer spot. All right, so I rode the waves for a while. I decided I need to get out of the wind. Um, I don't want to make the paddle all the way back to the ramp because it's putting a lot of strain on my rudder and my pedal drive. I've had a pedal drive snap on me. I've had the rudder snap on me. I don't want to deal with that today, um, so I need to get to a safer spot where the wind's not, you know, pushing me all over the place. So I need to make it between these two islands. Problem is, the tide is going out, so the water is getting pushed through these two islands, and it makes a, a channel, and it's it's just pushing hard. Then I got the wind coming from the other direction which is causing the waves to get huge. You can you notice I'll, I'll spin left or right in here. That's more of the, the wind and the current taking control of my rudder and spinning me around. Um, my legs are burning at this point. I've been paddling a good ways, but I can't stop. You stop, the wind's gonna push you one way, the current's gonna take you another way. You're gonna end up smashing into something and breaking or you're gonna get pushed further out and then you're just gonna to have to paddle that much longer so I'm trying my best I gotta get through this channel and then hook around to either side whichever side's easier but the back side of one of these islands is gonna give me some protection from the wind I kind of catch my breath check on my pedals check on my rudder make sure everything's good and then ride the storm out um, until it's a little bit easier to make it back All right, so I made it through the cut. The, uh, somehow the camera got knocked around. So I needed to adjust it. But I, I gotta make it to the backside of this island. It's pretty tough. I've got 
a headwind now. You can see some of the waves start to break over the bow of the kayak. Um, the only thing I got going for me is the current is heading in that direction. However, all the water is still getting channeled through these two islands. So it's not an easy paddle, but I know I gotta, I gotta make it to the backside of this island just so I can get a break, catch my breath, check on my pedal drive, make sure um, everything's good, nothing's broken. And really, uh, I need to just get to a safer spot and then check the weather app, see how long this storm's going to be and what my next um, course of action is going to be. All right, so I head up to this island, I throw anchor, get set up. I'm gonna have to hang out here for about an hour until the wind starts to die down. The wind never really went away, but uh, it did calm down enough to where I felt better about making that paddle back to the ramp. No fish on this episode, um, kind of boring, but I figured it was kind of important to show you what can happen while you're out there on the water. Um, brought to you by San at Assassin Baits. Go check them out on Instagram. Um, they're good stuff. That's really all I got on this episode. I just wanted everybody to see what can happen when a storm hits you and uh, how I got out of there. Check your weather apps and check them often. We'll see you next time.